Hey guys, Kelly Vaughn with the Vaughn team at Keller Williams. I am your real estate fairy godmother because I can make all your dreams come true. Thank you so much for tuning in. We appreciate you um, watching and sharing these videos if you find them helpful. Today I want to talk about a phenomenon in the marketplace that is becoming very, very common and can be a good tool for some homeowners, but also you need to understand that convenience comes at a cost. And this is the instant cash offer, um, two weeks close um, buyers, the um, offer pad, open door, knock, you know, all of those. You've heard the commercials, you've seen the ads, you've probably gotten a mail, a mailer from them saying, um, you know, I wanna buy your house now and here's what I'll pay you for it. These companies are investors. So keep in mind, keep that in mind when you are evaluating their services. Also, please keep in mind that they're using an algorithm to value your home and it does not take into account the unique features and benefits that your home has. All it's doing is running a series of numbers and coming up with a value. That may not be the actual market value of your home. In fact, it often won't be. Um, it'll often be lower than market value because the people, the buyers, the um, not buyers, the sellers that are attracted to these um, offers are people that need to get out of their house quick. And the convenience of not showing your house, um, not having to get it ready for staging or photography or keep it show ready or do any um, updates or improvements to it is worth is the is worth the loss in value and is worth the additional fees that you're going to pay um, for the convenience of selling your house quickly and not having to do the traditional process. How much more are you going to pay? That, that, I mean, that's honestly the crux of the question. And generally it's about double. Um, the fees will end up being about double what a traditional real estate, real estate um, transaction is. Um, so where you might pay 6% on the traditional side, on the iBuyer side, the um, online offer side, you're gonna pay 13 to 20%. And if the convenience of not having to get your home ready is worth the extra fees, then that's great. Um, those can be a good, off, a good option for a lot of people if you just need to get out of your house. Um, and you don't have the money or the time or um, the willpower to do what's needed to get your house ready to put it on the market and endure this home selling process, which let's be honest, it's a pain. It is an absolute pain in the rear. It is inconvenient at best to keep a home show ready and it is annoying at worst. Um, and especially if you've got pets or small children, it's a hassle, it's a huge hassle. And look, I'm a real estate agent and I understand that, I appreciate that. Like I have often joked with, my husband that I don't know why clients don't hate us because we make you move and moving is a pain. Even under the best circumstances, moving is a hassle. So just keep in mind that the convenience of an iBuyer comes at a cost. And that cost is generally double what it will be in a traditional real estate transaction. So I've got a really great graphic that I'm gonna put down in the comments on this video so that you can see sort of apples to apples numbers wise, um, just sort of a caveat emptor, a little buyer beware um, for you guys as homeowners and consumers. So if there's ever anything we can do for you, please don't hesitate to let us know, even if it's just an honest market value on your home or an idea of what your home might bring in today's market. We're happy to provide that to you at no obligation. So um, that's it. Thanks for watching, have a great day. Be kind to one another, please. And don't forget, we're never too busy for your referrals. Have a great day, bye.